Hey everybody. So I bought this shaft extension for my wheels so that I could make larger bowls and trim them because this will make the uh, bat go above the rim of the wheel. But my wheel head is stuck so I thought I would take you through taking that off uh, so everybody could see. So what I have is a Phillips head screwdriver a piece of house wire and a small piece of rope. I'll use either the rope or the wire. I don't know yet. I'll have to look. But on the website, on the SCUT website, it's got a couple diagrams of how to take things apart. And this happened to be one of them, how to unstick your wheel head. So um, that's what we're going to do. So let's get to it. First, I'm just going to, there's two screws you have to take off for the bottom cover. Okay, so we have the flywheel here and the belt. So what happens is when you try and move the wheel head to, to take it off, this just keeps rolling it. The belt will slip. So what you have to do is either take the rope or the wire, tie it here and then around the leg so it won't go anywhere and then you can twist your head off. So what I think I'm going to do if I have enough wire I'm going to use the wire because it has less give in it. I think we got enough. So I'm going to wrap it through here. And then I'm just going to wrap it around the leg and twist. so that it can't go anywhere. All right, so let me see if I can turn this around so you can see. So my wheel goes in a counterclockwise. So let's see if I can. Go. Finally. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to clean that off. I'm going to put some grease on there. I'm going to put some grease on the top and bottom. But this is how this goes on here. Like so. And then the wheel head goes on top of that and it puts it above the rim a little bit. Whereas now it's just below the rim. So I'm going to clean some of this off. It's actually not too dirty.
All right, it comes supplied with uh, some sort of lubricant, and that's what we're going to use. put a little bit on the inside. The wheel head itself. So I might as well talk about the wheel since I have it up here right now. Um, so this is the Scud Professional. It's uh, built like a tank. Cast iron. Um, I only have two issues with it. One, it's supposed to be able to center 400 pounds of clay. I personally don't think it goes fast enough to do that. Um, I could be wrong. Obviously, I am because that's what it claims. And um, but I, I just can't see it centering 400 pounds of clay going the speed that it goes. Um, and the pedal. So I just got the regular pedal. I think there's another pedal you can get that's more sensitive. But the regular pedal that comes with it, like if I'm, I push it down to the speed that I want. And then when I lift my foot up, all of a sudden it slows down to hardly nothing. So then you have to go back and tap it, you know, to where you want it. Um, is it a showstopper? No, but it would be nice if it would stay, you know? So those are the only two really issues that I have. And I don't even know that it won't center 400 pounds of clay because I haven't tried it. I'm just saying, I don't think it will, but Maybe that's another video down the line just to get 400 pounds of clay on here and see if we can center it. Um, so, but hey, we got the wheel head off. That was the main thing we wanted to do today with this wheel. And um, so until next time, take care.